Hey and welcome to Not Only Hollywood. Today I'm going to review Hellraiser 4 Bloodline from 1996. This is an American horror movie. The story about how the puzzle box was created. Hellraiser Bloodline is the fourth movie in the series and it's much better than Hellraiser 3 Hell on Earth. The story is more interesting and we visit three time periods and the topic is Hell and Bloodlines. A toy maker creates the dangerous puzzle box that opens up the gates to hell and after that we visit two time periods and we end up in space. Yes and F Jason Voorhees. The runtime is 80 minutes before the end credits show up on the screen so that's pretty short. The stupid studio trimmed down the runtime by 30 minutes or so and you notice the movie is missing a lot of dialogue and better storytelling. Welcome to Hollywood. Hellraiser Bloodline feels a little cheap especially when we visit a space station that doesn't feel like a space station but there are so many other movies with a lower budget that have the same problem. And you have the usual cheap and sterile rooms and hallways that feel fake and dead. This isn't a great movie, but after the disaster that was the previous movie, this was at least entertaining. But it's not like you care about the dead and boring human characters in the movie since they lack personality. These aren't characters like in the first two movies, so you wait for the Cenobites to kill them. I guess that was something the studio removed. Stupid idiots. Regarding the Cenobites, they are pretty dull except for the King of Pain, Pinhead. The dog is silly as hell and it looks so bad. After the third movie, the Hellraiser movies lost its way and yeah, we just have to live with that choice. The creepiness is gone. Even if the story was destroyed by the stupid studio, I still like what Hellraiser Bloodline is trying to do. The story is a mess but you still feel there's something interesting here that wasn't allowed to be shown to the audience. From 1 to 10 I give Hellraiser Bloodline a 5 out of 10. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.